An 11 year old boy taking the jazz scene by storm. Lester Holt is a music lover himself, and he caught up with this young man. Lester, good morning. Good morning, man. Great to see you. You know, like uh, I am a self taught bass player, and like me, Joey Alexander is completely self taught. But unlike me, this guy's on his way to becoming one of the greatest jazz pianists of our time. Take a look. An artist like Joey comes around maybe once in a lifetime. He's playing jazz music with the depth and soul that I don't think any of us have ever seen before. When I was in my mom's womb, I would listen to jazz. For me, jazz is about freedom to express yourselves. Jazz makes me feel happy, joyful, and thankful. When you look in nature, you hear wind, you hear sounds, trees. It's also like music. What we are music is nothing. It's like darkness. Really. Nice. <laughs> Hello, Joey. Hi. <laughs> so nice to, to meet you. I'm looking forward to playing with you. I love playing with other people, you know. Even you just met, you know, you could just jam with them. You play and I'll catch in. Even if you're from other countries, but in jazz, you're one. If you play in jazz, it's still the same language. The first time I played was a song by Thelonious Monk. You played Thelonious Monk at, <laughs> at six? Yeah. Do you remember how it goes? Yeah, I played the I was playing. <laughs> Awesome, man. <laughs> you heard that too. Yeah. And then when you started playing, did the music just come to you? Yeah. Joey Alexander. What's it like being in front of the crowd? It's happy and maybe a little bit nervous. I want to make the audience feel good when I play. You've had a pretty amazing life for 11 years old. Thank God. <laughs> what, what do you want next? For me, I just want to keep playing. Only jazz? Well, yeah, I mean, jazz is my music. Okay. That was wonderful. Thank you. Awesome. What a pleasure. <laughs> oh, Lester, my kids are so grounded. <laughs> so grounded. Joey Alexander is hey, here. Joey. Hey, Joey, how are you? Good. You called that little piece of music at the end there Lester's Blues, right? <laughs> is that because he couldn't hang with you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what did you think of his bass playing? It was wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> he, by the way, he looks at me first. He goes, oh, it, was, it was wonderful. I know you don't really like the term jazz prodigy, do you? I mean, I just like to be as myself, as a jazz musician. I mean, I know many people call me a prodigy. I mean, okay, I thank you, but I, I still want to be called a jazz musician. I hear you. Yeah. Yeah. Joey, do you have other hobbies? Do you have other hobbies that more 11-year-olds are probably into right now? Or at this stage of your life, is it all about the music? Well, I like kinds of things. You know, watching movies. Playing toys. Just like, like my 11 year old. Yeah. Exactly right. <laughs> Joey, as you can see, with us now, he's accompanied by Sammy Miller on drums and Russell Hall on the bass. So, Joey, why don't you just take it away, guys? Yep. Go ahead.
Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Joey Alexander, Joey, thank you so much. We really appreciate it. What a pleasure hey, to meet you. Great job, man. Guys, thank you. Lester, thank you so much for bringing him to us. And again, his debut album is called My Favorite Things. Up next, a real...